Hello. It has its ringing. Just doing a quick check. Testing. Testing. Okay. Okay. Anyways, curb. It's the curb game. Oh my god. Where's... I need to switch the controls. Why is that not the default? Like, why is that not the default? It even says right there that this is type B. Why is type B the default? Can you explain this to me? Okay, so final world. The dark castle. Very ominous. Very purple. Donut lifts. As if Kirby can't just fly. But yeah, we gotta we gotta lead up. Gotta lead up to the castle. Yep, yep, this is this is definitely a Castlevania moment right here. Okay, now we're in. And there's auto scroll. Oh god, oh god, I'm not gonna make it. Okay, I made it. Uh, ow! And Kirby auto scrolls will crush you. They feel no remorse. Okay, cool, thank you. Thank you, curb. Oh, curb game. <laughs> Hello, Miles and Bingo Bo. Bingo Bo. Come on, come on. No, no, no. <laughs> he keeps faking me out with that right now for some reason. But whatever, he's dead. You should try to beat a Kirby game without mid-air jumps. You mean like, the floating? I thought about it. But, not right now. Okay, falling. Going in the water. The purple water. I turned the brightness down on my OSSC a little bit. Because, like I said, the one chip Super NES is kind of bright. At least I think I said that. It is true, though. You get your choice of the lot here. Waluigi Castle! Of course, that's only on the Super Nintendo version, because, you know, in the... <laughs> if you're playing this on a Game Boy... <laughs> yeah, cool, cool music override, thank you. If you're playing this on a Game Boy, it's just gonna be green. Everything is green. <laughs> okay, so here's like a floatless challenge. Ham Hamter can't float. Hello, Isaac. Oh. Eat. Yeah, you can kind of just burn him. But now I'm gonna become the Electro Man. Okay, that's the end of the level. Yes! 38 lives. 
Almost enough. Ah, no. Kabu jump scare. I feel like Kirby games tend to do that a lot, where they're just like, yeah, here's an enemy, here's an enemy, by the way. Just, just right here. Yeah, so can't float with this guy. Oh, why did I do that? Why did I do that? That's not the game. That's just, why did I, why did I think that would work on a Gordo? I've had several words, <laughs> several worlds, several words to say about Gordo. What's everybody's thoughts on Kirby Blowout Blast? Is that the 3DS thing? Because I, I thought it was all right. I mean, it was clearly... <laughs> it was clearly them agonizing over how to design Forgotten Land, but... Bingo Bo, the, the arrow doesn't really work if you're responding to the streamer. <laughs> Hello, Zero Janitor. This is this is a simple but effective copy ability. You know, it's not too flashy, but it gets the job done very nicely. like a maze. Sort of. Oh wait, am I... Am I falling victim to the maze? Am I looping? No, I'm not looping. Oh, hey, Mr. Flosty. Oh, well. Oh, oh, well. This is a freezy man. Levels aren't terribly long. Wait, wait a minute. Why was that one two? Oh, is it because I got the star? I think it's because I got the star. <laughs> uh, <laughs> ow. I was trying very hard not to have that happen. So you remember that other level? Well, this is it. <laughs> Mirrored. We flipped it the other way. Enjoy. Ow. Mmm, Maxim Tomato. Why is it- why is it a Maxim Tomato and not a Maximum Tomato? I never understood that. Have you gotten to the Naked Lady stage yet? Yes, I have. I got banned from Twitch for eight days. Not really. The ninja, cubic ninja. He's gonna mod my Game Boy. Okay, I I don't think I like fighting this guy with Cutter. Okay, that's the level. Yeah, I, I got the timing for this mini game down pat. I I figured it out. I figured it out. So I, I looked at I looked at the chat and I, I should not have done that. But I got ADHD. It's gonna happen. Okay, the electro. 
Yep, yeah, and this is that other room flipped. We, we ran out of time around this point in development. Also, hey, the bitrate is actually decent today, so that's pretty cool. Oh, wait, no, no, sorry. I was just thinking about some. Thought I had to check something. Oh. Oh. Oh, but there's secret walls. Hang on, let me... I'm gonna post that in the Discord, because I don't- I don't usually do that. There. Because <laughs> you guys can just post those, like, mid-stream, but I don't usually do it. Because I kind of have a stream going on. Oh, back to Hamter. Can you go in here? Oh, but the one up is always on the other side of the wall. What the heck? There's like some kind of secret way to get those probably, but I don't I don't care enough. Oh wait, no, yeah, I thought maybe there was a secret down there. Turns out no, the secret is death. Bingo, but why do you want everybody to cheat so desperately? I, I would think that playing the game legit would be more entertaining. You know, Billy Mitchell, he could probably do it. <laughs> that one's pretty funny. Ah, uh, pink. Oh, I messed it up. Messed it up. King of Curb. We're almost through. Except we're not really through. You you all know that. Oh, okay. Oh, th cool, thank you. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> Chaos and maybe shenanigans. Well, I mean, I could play a Chaos Edition. That would probably be better. I don't think anybody's made a Chaos Edition for Kirby's Dreamland 2. Okay, more more auto scroll. Hey, buddy. Uh oh. Uh oh. That's not very nice. Just play a, a bullet hell at that point. I, I, I'm not entirely sure that I understand your logic, sir. Do not speak to me. You insult my sensibilities. But yeah, I feel like I remember this. I feel like I remember the stupid dark maze of death. How have I not died? How did I do that? How did I choose the right direction? How did I not deal damage to- He looks like Gooey when he has- when he doesn't have the spikes. Could- could Gordo be dark matter? Is that what we're learning here? I don't think we're learning anything. Also, yeah, Bingobo's right, his- his size makes him weaker. Because small Gordo is invincible. 
Oh, nope. I bragged that I had it- I had it down pat. And then, the universe was like, no. No, my son. Your hubris will be your downfall. Oh yeah, that, that's- that's real nice. It's like, you better move. You better move. Oh, hey, Gordo, we were just talking about you. Ow. Okay, do some jumps. Oh, okay, the dark room. Bingo Bo said use the spark ability, but I am not convinced he actually knew this would be the case. Small Gordos should be Gorditas. <laughs> yes. It's the Undertale room. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Oh, you gotta, you gotta choose one. And I chose poorly. You gotta come here with ice. I mean, fire. To get rid of the ice. Hey, look, it's the Sonic Origins DLC blocks. The mission blocks. Uh-oh, it's the mummy. Yeah, Kirby's weird, because there's some of these rooms where it feels like you're supposed to platform. Like, a lot of Kirby games are designed like that, where it, it, it's like there's platforming challenges, but the devs forgot you can do this. I don't know. Sometimes I don't understand Kirby. Both the series and the character. He's, he's, he's beyond comprehension, truly. Oh. Ow. Yeah, give me umbrella. And that's it, I guess. There we go. Yeah, I can make it I can make it like red brown if I want to. I don't, but I could. Anyway, here we go. King Dedede. He's having- he's- he's doing a bit of sleepwalking. Ow. You know what, we're gonna fight him the old-fashioned way. Uh-oh! Don't do that, d d d d Uh-oh. Oh wait, never mind, I'm fine. I'm fine. Oh, I want his hammer. Oh no, he's mad. He's he's so mad. DDD's pissed. You can tell because he's vibrating. Ow. I remember this boss fight being kind of hard. But it may take me a try or two. Okay, but now he is back to normal. DDD has returned. He has calmed down. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Uh-oh, now he's mad again. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, I was so close, too. I was so close. Don't worry, we'll get it. We'll get it. It's not too bad.
Ow. Oh, the double D. Ow. I, I keep forgetting that, that that hurts me. Rage. He's the angriest penguin you've ever heard. He's an angry arctic bird. Oh. Oh, we got him. We got him, boys. There we go. He's dead, and clearly that's all that needs to be done. Waddle D. He made this game. You got the Super Game Boy colored ground. You can definitely see the limitations of this technology. Mum Mumbies, Glunk, Rocky, Flamer, Floaty the Drifter, Elidal, Crack Tweet. Hey, that's what I see on Twitter almost every day. Bouncy Tie, <laughs> Propeller Bomb. Load Kibble. Is it, is it supposed to be Lord Kibble? Maybe it was an A. I don't know. The font's kind of small. Masher. Efreedy. Jumper Shoot. Mm, these are some good enemy names. These are Master Green. But he's white. These are like some enemy names I'd come up with. Why you. Except for that one. Captain Stitch. Oh, I like that one. I like that. Oh, Wispy Woods, they took his face off! <laughs> Nelly and Ruff. Sweet stuff, for some reason. Ice Drake, yeah, yeah. And we, we know these guys. And we know that guy. And we know that guy. And... Huh? But the manual... The manual told us who that was. I don't know if that's supposed to be a spoiler. And Kine is taking a while because he is a fish. Frankly, the fact that he's even doing this well is a miracle. But we know. We know that that's not it. That's not the end. We gotta collect the Duma Flotchers. So let's see. I needed fire. Uh oh. Needed fire. Which I'm pretty sure this stage provides. Okay, and I can bring Electro here. Okay, fire. So if I bring Electro to that room, there might be something hidden in there. Okay, but let's see what's in here. Oh, okay, so it might be you have to, like, memorize the combination. So, fire. I electro. Oh, no, wait, 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 wait. I know what it is. You, there's a combination in the first room, I bet. And then once you get that... 
you can learn. You can learn which doors you gotta go into. Ow. Uh-oh. Kirby's gonna die. But I thought Kirby was unkillable. Okay, no. Gotta have, uh... I think fish for this door. Yes, I know. I know I'm low on hell. Now, which world had... Which world had the level... That I could just, uh... Choose fish. It wasn't this one, I don't think. Might have... Might have been this one. And it was like lev... It was either the last level or... It was... I mean, it's in the first screen, so I'll know it when I see it. Yeah, here we go. I really wish I had health right now. Yeah, there we go. Light bulb. I can't wait to take damage. No, no, wait. I got a health refill when I get the fish. That's right. That's right. But you gotta jump. Fish can't fly either. Okay, so, yeah, it tells you the, the combination. Might need somebody to write this down in the chat for me. So it's okay. Fire, rock, needle, ice cutter. Fire, rock, needle, ice cutter. Fire, rock, needle, ice cutter. Okay. Fire. Stone, Luigi. <laughs> no. Poor kind, he's going through it. Needle. Ice. Give me that. And now, Cutter. He can just- he can just send out the shock wave. And there we go! Very simple. And I can just leave the stage, right? Okay, so we got two other worlds where we need to get one of these. Go to this one. Um, I forgot what level it might be. There's only three levels here, so... So, I just have to jog my memory a little bit. I'm gonna try not to use a guide unless I absolutely have to. And I, I think we can get it done without. Kind being a fish, he excels in the water. I feel like there was, like, a water path that I had to go through at some point that I needed him for, and I didn't have him. I forgot. Down was, like, progress, right? I might have wanted that. Yeah, like, something like this. I might have wanted to go the other way, I don't know. Ah, uh, yeah, this- this room, because it's the one- It's the one with the 300 enemies that are just at every intersection ever. Ow. 
Ow. You rotten frog? Blood ocean. Iron lung. Okay. What, what kills me is that <laughs> the creator raised the price of iron lung and when asked why, he said, because I wanted more money. <laughs> and I'm like, you know, I, I can't argue with that. <laughs> I can't. Okay, let me let me try the other direction. Okay, okay, uh, okay. Oh wait, hang on. We don't have a uh, double audio or anything, do we? No, we don't. Okay. I got that back panel line in audio because for some reason the Super Nintendo and the OSSC have audio skips on my capture card. Okay, okay. Yeah, so like this door right here. Ah, oh, crap. I still need the freaking thing. Is there any, like, yep, secret door. Now what kind of... Is that, like, electro? No, because that's the... Maybe it's stone. Because electro is, like, the, uh... The microchip blocks. Well, the good news is I know where to get stone. I like that there's a score. A score counter. Like... Yeah, do you know anybody that ever cared about score in like Mario or Sonic or Kirby? Like anyone. Was there- was there ever a kid at school that actually like- was like, look at this score I got in Mario World. Yeah, there we go. There we go. Okay, one left. I have no idea where it is in here. So there's four stage. Let's check stage four. We'll go backwards. The good thing about stone is it makes you invincible. So you can just do that. No, I'm not gonna take the hamster. And yeah, that looks a lot better with the brightness turned down. I need to do that mod that makes my Super Nintendo not so bright, but uh, you have to like solder some resistors and I'm, I'm scared and I don't have the equipment. <laughs> I have a soldering iron and that's basically it. And it's not a very good one. I, I want to, I kind of want to get a better soldering iron before I try that. And probably some flux, and some sod a solder sucker. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. And a fume extractor. Penicil. Isn't that the stuff you take, like, when you're having an allergic reaction? Oh, okay, you need, a uh, fire. 
you need fire if you want this to work out at all. But yeah, it's just... It's just money that I, I do not have to spare right now. Especially if I ever want to get, like, a retro tank 4K. Because the blasted thing is $700. I mean, listen, I understand how robust that thing is. But you can't look at me and tell me that that is not an insane price. Also, if the Switch 2 comes out at any point. And, you know, people think that it might be. It just might be. I'm... Ow. I'm gonna need money for that. Especially if they d announce, like, Oh, Paper Mario, the Thousand Year Door will run at 60 FPS on the Switch 2. Then it's basically over. It's basically over at that point. Where, where's Bernie Man? Where's Bernie Sadner's? Bernie Stolar. <laughs> I thought he was in there, but maybe he's in here. There he is. The Switch 2 is probably coming sooner rather than later, but also people have been rumoring it for like four years. So my knee-jerk reaction is still, sure, Jan. Like I said, I, I wasn't buying it until Pioro said it was coming, and now I, I'm like, yeah, it's, it's coming. It's coming, and if Paper Mario the Thousand Year Door runs at 60 FPS, then so am I. Oh wait, this guy's fire. Why did I think this guy was Needle? Oh, well, well, I know exactly why I thought he was Needle, but... He kind of looks like a hedgehog. It is a good song, though. The silly little ditty. I just wish it wasn't the only thing you ever heard while you were playing this game. But I'm glad if we're forced to listen to a song, at least it's a good song. I like how Scarfy just explodes. Oh, hey, those are made- those are made of ice. See, that's a trap. You fall in there and you can't do it no more. Oh, okay. <laughs> Hamster can't do this. And then it's gonna be like, no, no, actually you needed the hamster. You needed it, now you don't have it. Oh, no, wait, actually you need fish. I think. Well, definitely if I can't, like, get rid of this. Oh, uh, yep, yep, that'll do it, yeah. <laughs> okay, so I need to come back with fish again, and this time, don't fall in the pit. Falling in the pit, generally not advised. This song is what plays in my head every single day. Like, I'm just sitting there like, Ah, uh, cool. Cool enemy. <laughs> uh... 
Why did they ever get rid of these guys? Like, how did they look at the fish on the warp star and say, no, we don't want any of that? Do they have no god? But then wait, how do I, how do I get rid of the blocks beneath? Oh wait, uh, after I get through the ice, I probably don't need the fire anymore. So it's engineering it to where you have to get through with this very specific combination. And that's how they do the secret platforming challenge. Oh right, right, I remember now. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I remember. I remember. Oh, boy. Oh, joy. Oh, Troy. Do you guys know that episode of Billy and Mandy where Scar has the uh, <laughs> hole in his stomach? And he, he, he doesn't remember how he got it, and then he presses a button on his car and it shoots a laser through the hole. And he goes, oh yeah. <laughs> that was, that was me just now. <laughs> but yeah, the, the hitbox on the fireball is a little weird. Oh. I didn't mean to do that. Wow. That's a quick death. Oh, it's- it's gooey! Collect him! What kind of fish is Kine? Is he a sunfish? I mean, look at that. Look at those hitboxes. <laughs> Have you ever seen a hitbox in your life? Such as that? Okay, okay. I'm, I'm kind of scared to do anything. Because I'm, I'm worried- Oh no, you gotta not break the ice. That's the trick. The ice is there to tempt you. Tempt you with promises. He's like a- he's like a sunfish of some sort. You have got to be kidding me. And here's a Gordo, just in case you want to kill yourself. Okay, we'll try this again. Oh, no, I need that. Let's 
Something I've learned over my years, Isaac, is that the happier the music, the greater the pain. Cool! Cool power. It's just like the fireball won't hit. It won't hit. I'm gonna have nightmares about this guy. Oh. Yeah, yeah, good, good, good. So, okay, I got Rick one time, but then I keep getting gooey, which leads me to believe that it's trying to give me kind and failing. So, can I get kind from here? There we go. Uh-oh. Do not fall in the hole. Oh, no! <laughs> no! No! Okay, we're gonna- we're gonna science here. Fish? Do I get the fish? Or do I only get the hamster? Oh. We're gonna find this out. Okay, hamster. I'm gonna try once more. And if I get the hamster again, then I will know. Okay, no, it's just hamster. I mean, look, Gooey showed up. Gooey was there. Ba -da -ba -da -ba -ba. Drop a bag on my head, and then I'm in a fish. Yeah, please die at your earliest convenience, thank you. I, I- I need you not. Okay, so it's just if you have- If you have fish, then it will not give you hamster. Sometimes it does. But not this time. Ow. Oh, please let me jump out of this. Okay. <laughs> oh god, that was so close. Because you, you saw how many times that went like straight through the thing. It went straight through it. But the game's like, nope, nope, not good enough. Not good enough. That's like some Jekyll and Hyde hitboxes. There you go. Okay, okay. Now for the maneuver. 
the maneuver. Ready? Hang on. I, first, I want to get rid of these guys. They... They make me uneasy. Okay, okay. Okay, this is not good enough. Wait, can I, like... No, I can't. Okay. No! God, why did I do that? This game is stupid. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. To hell. Gooey, save me. Thank you. Yeah, what was- what was Bingo Bo saying about bullet hell? I think I'm seeing it now. Oh, I love this part so much. I love it. Really, really love how hard it is to do this one simple thing. Okay. Okay. Slowly falling. Create a star. Commit kill. Don't actually get the thing. Wait. Why is the, why is the owl here? This, it's gotta be random. You're making fun of me, but it's gotta be random. Ow. Cool enemies. Cool game. Okay. Okay. We got past the part. Now just for the other part. Cool. Thank you. Thank you. Like I said, and I love that they have this trap here to trick you into getting greedy. Okay, okay. Now then. All right. We are in the gravy. Do not go in the door. You disgusting sunfish, you. All right. All right. Now, I believe we got them all. Let's double check. Yep. We are all good. <clears throat> Now we just have to engage DDD, motherfucker. Is there like a heal? Yeah. Can I like leave and come back? Because <coughs> that would be lovely. Oh no, it despawns. Okay. 
Oh. Anti-fish barrier. The cross for Jesus. Okay, that did- that did nothing. Alright, come on, day to day. It's kind of comical, like, how much less damage this does. But I guess that's good game balance, because it's so much easier to hit him with. Oh! Yep, flew right into his mouth. Yeah, do not become enraged. There is no reason to be upset. Prepare to DD die. And now, you must give him. The spinny doodad. Purge him of the evil. We got a sword. Ah, there he is. Dark matter. I remember having a lot of trouble with this fight, so we'll see how this goes. Well, not a good start. Ow. Yeah, I even worse. So you just wanna- you just wanna take what you can get. You don't wanna get greedy with it. Ow. Okay, so don't- don't do it after his dash. The dash is just generally not a good thing to be around. Yeah, okay, we'll, we'll- we'll try that again. We'll try that again. I always thought this fight was cool, though. Yeah, cause he always- he always, like, ducks back. Also, Kirby always does a double slash, it looks like. Ow. 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 Yeah, yeah, this- this fight is tricky. I think I'll be better at it now than I was then, but... Maybe not by a whole lot. Ow. Also, Isaac, yeah, that, that's- that's pretty much Kirby in general, to be honest with you. It's just like, you know... The game is really cute, and then, it, like, the last five minutes are like, Oh, dear God, what is that? Okay, that's- that's not a good start. Oh! <laughs> yeah, I almost feel like just forfeiting this time, but...
Yeah, honestly, the orb attack is the safest time to hit him, I think. Which is why I didn't do it just then. Ow. Yeah, this, this boss fight's not easy. Like, I remember the first time I played this, it, I remember thinking, God, that's this is difficult. Okay, that's, that's just not gonna do. That's not gonna work. Ow. And you, you can't get too close to it. Uh, you can't get too close because then he'll he'll fight back. Which I mean makes sense, but it, it, this is a video game, so does it does it have to? Must it? Dark matter is no, no one to be trifled with. Okay, when I said that was the safest time to hit him, I might have been full of crap. You kind of want to just like barely graze him. That's the that's the trick. You want to like cut off his toenails. Yeah, see cuz that's what happens when you don't. Oh. And this ain't like some of them other Kirby boss fights where you get like a gun. No, you got a sword, baby. You are you are playing a close range game here. Okay, I might I might have it figured out. Okay, but you better believe that's not it. <laughs> oh, but you can knock those back. Oh, oh crap. Well, well, it was a good run. <laughs> but of course he's got two phases. And you don't, you do not restart at phase two, so. Honestly, I'd go as far as to say this is probably one of the hardest final bosses in Kirby. I mean, maybe not counting, like, true super secret final bosses, you know? Like the kind you have to play through the, the arena eight times to fight. Ow. 
Oh, ow! Okay, this isn't going well. I mean, it's going better than when I started, but that's not saying a whole lot. There we go, okay. Cool bean, cool beanos. Okay, so what you want to do is you want to wait for him to do that. Oh, okay, he does this too, by the way. Oh, ow! Well, okay, that was the life where I learned where I learned he can do that, by the way. Okay, so he always does, like, the orb attack first. I wonder if you're supposed to just knock the orb back at him. Yeah, that does a lot of damage when you do that. So that's probably the actual strategy. <laughs> and they just- they did- they added this in case you just really wanted to, you know? In case you're a speedrunning piece of crap. Yeah, okay, that was pretty good. That was pretty- that was a pretty good first round. Okay, now is he gonna do the- yes he is, and I was ill-prepared to dodge. Does he, like, telegraph which way he's gonna do that? Oh, okay, that's- he can do that, too. Pretty cool. Oh, okay. That's a cool new attack I was not told of. Oh, crap, this is one of them- is this one of them Kirby's Adventure things where I have to kill him fast? Because I notice I am descending. Ow. Ow. Mmm, boss fight. Yeah, I think you're just supposed to wait for the orb and then just hit it back at him. <laughs> Ow. Ah, uh, uh, okay, I'm fine. But I think it, like, splits into pieces, so... The closer you can hit him with it, the more damage you do. Yeah, like that. Yeah. Yeah, boy. It's pretty funny how Kirby just has this enormous sword. I love that for him.
Okay, I managed to dodge that somehow. Okay. You can kind of just get behind him. Ow. Well, in theory, at least. I'm getting close. I'm getting close to beating him. I'm learning the strategy. Okay, not a good start. Generally speaking, you don't want to take all that much damage during this phase. Yup, yup, I'm dead. It's it's Jover. It's it's Jover. Yeah, just just kill me. I don't this is not a good attempt. But that's pretty good, though. Yeah, there we go. That's 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 more like it. Yeah, there we go. That's the kind of attempt you want. And he's gonna do the spin. Yep. Get a couple cheap shots in. Ow. Get a couple cheap shots in anyway. Now he's gonna explode. Ow. Yep, yep. I, I'm pretty sure you got... No, actually, you might not have a time limit. You might not have a time limit. Because I got down to Earth and I was okay. Oh, well, that's not good. Uh-oh. 
Uh oh, don't get don't get in his hitbox, Kirby. Uh oh. Don't like it when that happens. I mean, I've, I've done better, but I've also done worse. Okay. Yeah, so you can... You can tell which way he's going to start rotating. Okay, now do the splody move. Which it's kind of hard to hit him during. In my opinion. Well, this isn't this isn't going well. But I honestly kind of didn't expect it to. I mean, that's not how I thought I was going to die, but okay. But don't worry, don't worry, I got this. I got this. Pardon me. I know this is not exactly the world's greatest content, but, you know, boss a little bit hard. Not too hard, not like the worst thing ever, but... Okay. Not bad, not bad. Ow. That's pretty bad, though. Okay, so you can hit him with those, and that's pretty good. Ow. I don't know if it's, like... I don't know if I'm fast enough to actually dodge that, like, to go around it. I think it's just, like... You want to, like, just kind of weave out. Wait, did I get hit? I got hit there? Ow. <laughs> I'm getting, I, I'm, I'm sloppy. I'm a little sloppy. You can get a good few, like, cheap hits in on him at the beginning.
Ow. Why did I- why did I let him do that? I don't really even know. Uh, again, I, I really need to get out of the way. No, wait, actually. Ah! Okay, now the splody move. Ow. Again, why I let him do this, I have no idea. Wait, hang on, hang on. We did it! Oh no, Kirby's is all tuckered out. Sonic 2 ending. And yeah, here's some Super Game Boy for you. And see, DDD, he was not a bad guy this time. He was just a little under the influence. So yes, that was- So water! But yes, th that was Kirby's Dream Land 2. Not a long game. Not a very long game at all. I think- I think it's kind of overhated sometimes, like, Kirby fans tend to speak poorly of this game. I think it's good. I mean, it might not be one of the stronger Kirby games, but I think it's still good. And yeah, this is- this is really a, so a Sonic ending. Sonic the Hedgehog ending. But honestly, I I've given Kirby kind of the shaft on this channel for a while. <laughs> you see? You see what they did there? You see? Ah. Hey, Super Game Boy. But yeah, I've given him kind of the shaft on this channel for a while. I'd like to stop doing that. So I might... I might have some more Kirby later in the year. I might... I might throw in the Kirby spin-offs every now and then. Like I talked about... You doing Kirby Pinball Land. I was slightly joking, but also slightly serious. So we might end up doing that. So it says 95%. So I don't know if... Like, does DDD get a minigame? I don't think he gets a... I don't think he gets a minigame. Kirby Block Ball has an insane condition for the final level. I feel like I remember that. I feel like I remember that being the case. I'll have to look up what that is. To see if I want to do it. Okay, so, no, he, it's not a minigame. This is just the final boss, no matter what. Oh, didn't mean to do that. So, let me see, I need to... I need to check the minigames. Make sure we did them all. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I did Krakos, but we'll- we'll do it again anyway. Maybe I need to get a perfect on all of them. Well, I already messed this one up. Oh, I can't exit? I might have to reset the game. Yeah, I might have to... ...reset the game. You might have, like I said, you might have to get a perfect. I don't know. Maybe I, I might not bother with that on stream. I don't know. I don't know. Oh yeah, that's right.
Okay, so let's let's try that again. Let's try again. I think I can do it. There we go. Perfecto. Okay. Try this one. Oh, well, <laughs> already failed that one. So I need to come back for sun. Can I just like, uh, yeah, I can just do that. I can just press the buttons. This one's pretty hard. Oh, but that the stars do bounce off the ground. So you you don't you have a little bit more time oh crap. You do have a little bit more time to grab them. Than I think you do. But I mean, the stream ran a little short, so we might as well do it. We might as well try and doot. I almost messed that up right away. There we go. Just go backwards order, so it'll probably get easier. This, this one seems relatively simple in comparison. Okie doke. Man, these early Kirby games really like to just call everything Ripple. Ripple, whatever. I I'm pretty sure I did this one. I'm pretty sure I did this one. I'll do it again, though. Just play a quick game of Flappy Curb.
Yeah, stand on the mound. I don't remember if I did this one. I'm gonna be real with you. Oh, well, I already messed it up. So I gotta come back to level two. I mean, maybe, unless I already did it. Give me that. Trying to throw curveballs at me. Like this is some kind of baseball game, but with apples. Okay, so one and two, I still gotta do. But it is counting. <sighs> it is counting. Try World Two again. Uh oh, uh, uh, well, okay, that was just unfortunate. That was an unfortunate set of circumstances. So you gotta be prepared to walk under the apple. That could have been nasty. All right. Now just world two. And we should be good. Should be good. I've already messed it up. Yep, already messed it up. Oh, but we're so close. 
You might just- you gotta get a little bit- Oh, no! Okay. <laughs> I don't think I can duck down through those platforms, which would make the whole thing a lot easier. But I guess I- I should try. I should at least try. Oh, okay, actually I can, never mind. Never mind, I'm just an idiot! And I'm stupid. Not that much fun. Okay, now I, I think that's it. see what the game has to say about this as we watch the border fade in and out for the 30th time 99 okay did I miss one this is like the uh, the fish yeah this is the fish which I I did perfect twice Oh, okay, I can't leave without getting hit. Did I do Iceberg? Yeah, because that was the one that was like fallen. I mean, I did this. I mean, hmm. Hmm. Yeah, and I, I did crack those. Unless one of them didn't save? But I wouldn't know which one that is. And DDD doesn't seem to have a mini game. Oh. Didn't mean to do that. Hmm. Let me look this up. Let me see if the internet knows what's going on. Okay, so it says stage two, three, or stage five, three, bottom right door. You gotta, there's like a random event you gotta see. So we're gonna, we're gonna grind out the random event. Which door was... which door did it? The bottom right door. This would probably be easier if I had a power. But, you know, actually we can- we can just tank it. So, like, there's a random chance that something special will come out of the bag. There you go. See, it's girl gooey, I think. And she gives a one-up. Okay, let's see. Is that enough to get us to 100? Hey, 
Yay! And now we got option. So you got sound boss bonus. So sound, as you'd expect. You get this art, though. So here you can listen to all the music you couldn't hear during the main game because... because the animal buddies were overriding it. FGM. I, I'm guessing it stands for foreground music, which I think it's, it's just sound effects. Yeah. Which is... It, foreground music is not usually what we call those. Okay. But, yeah, so... You can probably predict what the other do others do, but I'll show them anyway. Yeah, so if you want to fight the bosses again, you can, you know, have a boss rush. You can fight Wispy, kill the tree again. I wanted that. I wanted to eat those. Oh, but I, I'm locked in here. You're not locked in here with me, I'm locked in here with me. And, you know, you can probably guess, but yeah. You can play the bonus games all in a row if you want to. I wonder, if you get hit, do you move on to the next one or do you just lose? Yeah, you move on to the next one, so you can try to get your best score. Can you get all perfects in a row? I- I can't, probably. I'm not gonna try. <laughs> I'm not gonna try. But thank you for watching a curb- a very curb adventure. A very curvy Christmas. Clap like the people in the game. Clap for me. Clap for me, Jimmy. But yeah, uh, I, I don't know what I'm doing next. I mean, next stream is probably either going to be Mario RPG post-game or Super Mario Wonder post-game. I don't know which. You'll have to tell me in the Discord which one you want. I'll probably ask when it comes time. And then after that, I don't know. When are you going to do a game's pre-game? We did that. We did that with this one. I read the manual. But, uh... <laughs> yeah, so I don't know. I don't know after that, though. Uh, maybe Spyro. Because we were talking about doing Spyro the Dragon. And I'll be playing that mostly blind. I, I know a little bit about Spyro, but not too much. So that'll be interesting. But until then, I will see you around. Have a good night, or day, or whatever it is for you when you're watching this.